Lewis dot structure for covalent compounds. First begin with a compound element. For example, PF3. Phosphorus has five valence electrons, while fluorine has seven. Since there are three elements of fluorine, 7 times 3 equals 21. There are 26 valence electrons in total. Next, set up the dot structure by putting the element with the least electronegativity in the middle. In this case, phosphorus has the least electronegativity. Now start to sort out the 26 valence electrons. Remember, each element needs to have 8 electrons. To make sure, circle each electron. Each element contains eight valence electrons. Your structure is correct. Carbon has the least electronegativity, so it goes in the middle, while on its sides is oxygen. Now start filling in the 16 valence electrons. This compound has double bonds, which mean that a pair of electrons will bond together to form one in order for the structure to have 16 electrons. To make sure the structure is correct, circle the element's eight valence electrons. I hope you found this useful. Thank, Thank you. you.